Hi, my name is Merlin, and I'm part of the founding family of Micro. After almost 10 years of experience in the electric scooter business and having developed over 50 lightweight micromobility products, we are proud to present to you our first e-bike. Today, we will have a closer look at it and explain to you all the important features of the product. With 14.5 kilograms, the micro e-bike is one of the lightest foldable e-bikes on the market. It is sporty and powerful and can be folded within seconds. Besides being lightweight and compact, it has an exchangeable battery, which you can see over here, that can also be used as a power bank. This is quite cool. You have a USB port over here where you can just uh, plug in your smartphone or your tablet and uh, charge it on the way. The battery is magnetically attached uh, on the handlebar, so you can also uh, exchange it quite easily if you have a spare one, um, but we will look at it uh, in detail afterwards. First, let's get started and uh, set up the e-bike. Um, always important is, uh, before you start off, is to check all the contents of the, of the, of the box. So, of course, you have the battery inside, you have the, the user manual. Um, please carefully read it. There's some uh, important information in it. You have to attach one pedal, uh, which is quite easy, and uh, we can show you how, how it's done. Uh, then we have some tools, uh, a wrench and uh, some Allen keys and we have the charging cable as well. So please make sure you have that uh, in the box. Very important um, is always at the beginning to uh, quickly charge up the battery. Um, usually, I mean, it's fully charged. Uh, you can uh, just check by clicking on the, uh, on the button here and see if all the four um, uh, lights uh, lit up, then it's uh, usually fully charged. Now, let's, um, let's unfold uh, the e-bike. So, it's very compact, as you've seen before, um, and it's quite easy to, to unfold it. So basically, uh, this is the folding uh, position. It also stands quite uh, tight, so it uh, fits in a trunk or um, underneath a train seat. So uh, you can unfold it quite easily. You just need to basically do it like that. And then you have here a lever, which you need to push down, and a, a little security um, lock, uh, which needs to be folded down. And then uh, you just need to fold up the handlebar, click in, uh, it's already tightened, and then you have to stand over here, and that's it. It's uh, fully folded up. Let's just quickly attach the, the pedal. Um, it's quite easy. You just need to screw it in here. Make sure um, that you tighten it hard enough. Once you have tightened that, basically the um, e-bike is uh, folded up and, uh, and ready to go. Please also make sure before you use it um, that you check that all screws are well tightened. Um, you have the tools, so it's quite easy to, to, to check that. Um, also look that all the brakes uh, do work. Um, you can always adjust them on the, on the little knobs over here. You can tighten them or loosen them a bit, whatever you like. Also make sure when, once you ride that the folding mechanism is really locked into place. So you hear a little uh, clicking noise and then you know that uh, the bike is actually uh, ready to go. Last but not least, always check the, the, um, the tires. Um, usually, yeah, just pump them up a little more uh, once, once you unpack them out of the box and then you're basically ready to go. Now I want to explain to you the main features of the product and all the technical specifications. So uh, let's start off with the frame. It's made out of aluminum, so it's uh, quite um, uh, lightweight. Uh, as I said before, it's only 14.5 kilograms. Uh, it has 16-inch air tires that can be pumped like normal tires, as you know, on uh, normal bikes. Let's have a look at the e-bike and at the features. So uh, you have an adjustable handlebar, uh, so you can uh, change the, the height of the handlebar to your liking. It's uh, pretty easy to change that. Same goes for the seat can be also uh, changed uh, in height, um, quite easy and understandable. Um, make sure that you tighten the screw over here so that the, the seat really fits, uh, fits tight when you, when you sit on the bike. Let's go to the gear. So it has a, a Shimano six-speed gear shifter that can be shifted with your right hand over here. We have front and rear brake, uh, of course. It's not disc brakes, but uh, to be honest, uh, it's, it's uh, farly enough uh, for, for the speeds that we're going over here. Uh, we have mod guards in the front and in the rear as well. Same goes for reflectors. Front, the, the white reflector in the rear, the red one. 
Um, in some countries, it may be needed to have an additional light on top, uh, but that needs to be checked depending on your uh, country's regulations. Now I'm going to show you how to fold the e-bike. So before you fold, um, make sure that the pedal in front of you is facing downwards. And then you can easily just activate this lever over here, fold the e-bike together. And then the last step is activating the handlebar lever and folding it down. And like this, you have a pretty compact, fits in the trunk. Uh, you can take it in the train, uh, very compact. Um, we have also on top um, in the box, there is a small strap like this, which can be attached uh, over here. So you can uh, basically lock uh, the, the, the bike in this position so that it's not opening up. All right, let's uh, fold it up again and uh, have a look at the other features as well. So folding up is quite easy, I've seen it before. Now I want to show you my personal favorite feature, which is actually the exchangeable battery that can also be used as a normal power bank to uh, charge your smartphone or tablet on the go. Um, it's quite light, so it's uh, less than a kilo. And uh, the cool thing about it is that uh, if you're planning, a, let's say, a longer trip, you can always carry a second or a third battery with you and then just uh, expand uh, your range on the go. Um, with a single charge, you have uh, 25 kilometers of range and uh, it can be charged up in just three hours. Um, now I'm going to show you how to install it into the bike, so it's actually quite easy. Um, you just have to click it in, uh, you hear a clicking noise, uh, it's magnetical, so uh, it holds in place. And then you have just a security lever that can be pushed over here and it's safe and secured on top. Let's have a look at the motor. So the motor, it's a, it's a rear hub motor. It has a peak power of 400 watts and uh, speeds you up to 20 kilometers an hour. Uh, the cool thing is that uh, even if you run out of battery, uh, you can still ride it without assistance and it feels like a normal bike. So it's truly a hybrid. And finally, a few words about service and warranty. To ensure a long life of your e-bike, it is necessary to have your e-bike serviced by an authorized dealer or service center once a year or every 500 kilometer, whichever comes first. You will also find the micro pass at the end of the manual. It's uh, in each language. Please make sure to, to fill it out and keep it together with your purchase re receipt. Um, it just enables a smooth process in case of uh, any repairs or warranty claims. Further information regarding the warranty and service can be found uh, on, in the manual or on our website. All right, thanks a lot for listening and watching. Uh, if you have any questions about the e-bike, um, feel free to write us a comment uh, below or uh, just uh, write us an email or uh, check out our website. Thanks a lot. <laughs>